Today I talked about the latest events in the project. We also spoke about the plans of development of the project of Savalmash of Solo Group both. Today I also devoted part of my presentation to examples of using Slavaga technology motors in different types of transport. I spoke about people who already do that, who earn on that. And I offered to people to cooperate with Viktor Aristov, with Andrei Lobov in developing the technology, the Slavaga technology. I think that today there were quite many people, about 50 or 100 people. You know, for Bulgaria, where there are about 7 million people, it is a good result. And today it is important that we try to stake on quality, not quantity. Today we had important partners with us who built business in Bulgaria. So we saw everyone we needed. It makes us happy. Active people remain active. And we now have new partners and new people who want to promote the project in Bulgaria. It means that we do everything correctly. My impressions from today's conference are the following. Past investors, existing investors, future investors, they are very happy with the information they received. They received hope. Hope that they did not lose their money. They saw what they invested in. In equipment, in the building, in everything. The conference has finally ended. It ended with smiles of many people. There were many happy faces, many satisfied faces, full of hopes. People who look into their future calmly. And I hope and I think that I passed on my energy to the audience, that they received it in a positive way. And I also hope that after the translation my audience will also listen to it and it will also have and get some energy for future development and for its active promotion. We link something new and business relations. And business relations are built on human relations. You know, whether we have interest in each other, whether we trust each other. And you know, events like this one, they link people, they connect people, they organize people. Not only national representatives, but also people who are just at home and who are watching what I'm speaking about. I have been here, I've been received here, and we have come here to support our colleagues. And so they have positive emotions and they want to support us in their turn. And together we become stronger. My strongest impressions are from projects in India and in China. I received very important information that impressed me a lot. This is something relative to sanctions and their impact on Russia. Actually, it is quite positive. I was waiting for the news on Siemens leaving the market, which is really good. In August this year, there was an international conference in Moscow, when Dimitar came from Bulgaria as well as Plamen. The other citizens of Bulgaria unfortunately did not visit our conference. And today we have come to Bulgaria to share the information that I shared at the Moscow conference. To sum up intermediate results of the project financing. Fortunately, the results that I was speaking about in Moscow, they changed for the better. We are now moving on towards finishing of financing and realization of the project. To my mind, Dimitri and his team, they are unique partners. They see possibilities and not obstacles for achieving targets. Back in 2018, when no materials were translated, neither the website nor the back office, when none of it was translated in Bulgarian, Dimitri was translating the materials for citizens of his country. And back then, they were the first investments and the first inscriptions from Bulgaria. More than four years have passed ever since four years of Dimitri's systemic work and now we can see the results of the systemic work. Day after day Dimitri is doing things that help us develop this region. 
I am an investor of the project. I became it in 2018. I started with a small package, which I was increasing and which I have increased fivefold. And then I paid for a big package. Now I'm paying for another big package. My idea is that I will accumulate a big capital with the help of this company, which will pay back in the future. I love saying one good phrase. Time of risk investment is in the past. Now it is time of accumulating capital. Use that. Yes, I had doubts at the beginning, before I invested. It was about crowdfunding. Such projects and developments are made by big companies that invest directly and that produce and sell directly. However, at this conference I obtained answers to some of the questions and my doubts disappeared completely. We brought different materials for people to learn about them, we have kits for mounting them on different vehicles and we have electric motors for hand tools of several much development that will soon be produced in serious production. People could see all of that, they could touch that. They could touch on the Slavanka technology and see documents that they were worrying about, maybe, and to get answers to questions on what they had seen. The documents and the motors. There have been a lot of people here, we consulted them, we were speaking about the project to them. It means that people are interested. New electric motors will be in real demand given the ecological agenda that the governments have all over the world, these changes are inevitable, irrespective of whether they will be deferred in time due to the economic crisis that we are observing and watching today. It will happen either now or in five years, or maybe in ten years. These electric motors will be needed by the world in all aspects of human activities. And that is why I firmly believe in this project. At the beginning, when there was nothing, the main questions of investors were how would our money be spent, will they build anything at all, and what are they going to do? It was an uncertain future, wishes for the future, now things are totally different. With time, with years, people understood that all their money is spent reasonably. First of all, it is the laboratory to prove that the technology itself functions. The place where everyone who wants to try something, to test something, an electric motor, for example, they can do it there. Then construction started. We saw that things were constructed very quickly at a good quality level. And gradually, doubts in terms of the project, whether it will be realized or not, they just disappeared. Haters also left. They also stopped having doubts. They somehow understood that they were not right. People from Solar Group and Sovelmash, what are they to blame for? They show to all the investors that all the money was spent on what it had been meant for and that we are at the final stage of financing the project. The final stage that will finish the saga in a way. It will really convince the people. The final stage that will happen it is when the first dividends will be paid to all the investors of the project. Investors and partners in Bulgaria, I wish you to continue to invest in the project, to pay your installment payments in due time, to speak about the project to other people while there is still the possibility to invest in it, and to think about how we will develop the Slavanka technology in this region. Today we were speaking about the big prospects of development of the Slavanka technology in Bulgaria. And we are still waiting for people, for partners who can take on the responsibility for this area. And I'm sure that it will be one of the first European countries where there will be this technology, where it will be accessible by everyone and where everyone will be able to purchase products with the Slavanka technology.